Hello, this is an Astroneer tutorial on how to make blinking lights. This is a circuit to create blinking lights. What we over have over here is two sets of, of lights that we're going to be causing to blink. We just have one that is off and then we have a set that is conveying information where one is on and one is off. If I press this button, you can see that they start blinking and the one where one was on and one was off is flipping back and forth. How this circuit works is this power switch is being toggled on and off by the button repeater. When this power switch is on, it toggles this power sensor, which is set to gained or lost, which sends a signal through this delay repeater, and this delay repeater is how long your flash is. So if this is set real low, it's going to be a very fast flash. And if this is set real high, it's going to be a very slow flash. You can see up in the upper right hand corner, it's going much slower. And uh, the segment pin over here is going, is spreading off from the delay repeater to go to the lights we want to toggle on and off. One of the nice things about this design is that it always reverts back, it always reverts the lights back to the same state they were in at the beginning. So no matter when I turn on and off the button repeater, this light will always return to being off, this light will always return to being on, and this light will always return to being off. The reason for that is how this circuit turns off. So if this is on and we're turning it off, there's two spot possible states. There is a state where this is off, so we don't get any signal in here, but we already have a delay going through the repeater, so it gets turned back on. So this always ends up as off and on. And the other possibility is this is on. So when we turn this off, we send a signal through here, but we all already have a signal going through the delay repeater to turn it off. So that adds an extra signal through to turn it on. So you get kind of a double blink at the very end, but it returns to the state it was in before you started blinking the lights. So what if you want your lights to blink in unison and they have to convey information or you have a specific pattern and then you want them to just blink on and off all together. The circuit over here is how you do that. So first, let's turn this off. Uh, you can see that these lights are conveying information. This is set up with uh, basically some storage sen sensors, empty, not empty, and full, not full. If I output this canister, you can see that there's nothing in this canister and the light turns off. And uh, if I disable the output, it sucks back in that ammonium and we get our light on. The reason this works is for this section right here, which is keeping track of whether our lights are on and off. So uh, in this case, we have the empty or not empty sensor, which is going over to this sensor and the light. And what's, what's this doing is when we toggle the button, instead of just toggling our timing circuit on and off, we are also opening up these two power switches. So these power switches are keeping the information of whether the light is on or off in them in, in the fact that they're either going to be closed and not giving out power or open and giving out power. If they're open, when we open these things, it's going to toggle every, every light that is on to be off and then our blinking switch circuit is going to run everything as normal. When we turn it off, so because it's, it's still hooked up to the button repeater, it's going to send another signal because these, are, these power sensors are set to gained or lost to flip that light back on. So again, no matter what I do, they're going to turn on and off and then always revert back to the state they're in. So that is how to make 
blinking lights and how to keep the information they are displaying after you finish blinking. If you liked the video, please subscribe and thanks for watching.